There's lots of care and trouble in this world to swallow down. And old Sarah's pretty lively in her way of getting round. Yet there's times when I forget them. Aches and pains and troubles all. It's when I take it evening, my old banjo from the wall. About the time that night has fallen and my daily work is done. And above the shady hilltops, I can see the setting sun. When the quiet rest for shadows is beginning just to fall. Then I take the little banjo from its place up on the wall. Then my family gathers round me in the fading of the light. As I strike the strings to try them if they all is tuned all right. Now I feel we so now help I can hear the angels sing. As the music of that banjo sets my cabin all ring. My wife and all the others, male and female, small and big, even up to gray-haired granny, seem just bound to do a jig. Twill I change the style of music, change the movement and the time, and the ringing little banjo plays an old hard feeling high. And somehow my throat gets choky, and the lump keeps trying to rise, like it wanted to catch the water that was flowing to my eyes. And I feel that I could sort of knock the socks clean off a of sin. As I hear my poor granny with her trembling voice giant in. Then we all throw in our voices for the help to tune out too. Like a big camp meeting choir trying to sing a mourner through. And our folks let out the music sweet and solemn loud and free. As the rafters of my cabin echo with the melody. Oh, the music of the banjo. Quick and deblish, solemn, slow. Is the greatest joy and solace that a weary slave can know. So just let me hear it ring and know the tune be po and rough. It's a pleasure, and the pleasures of this life are few enough. Now the blessed little angels up in heaven, we are told, do nothing all their lifetime except and play on hogs of gold. Now I feel heaven be more homelike if we'd hear some music fall from real old-fashioned banjo like the one up on the wall.